Welcome back to the vlog, sisters. We are at the Grand Cayman. So excited. Last night was our first night. I didn't vlog anything, but today I'll be vlogging. This is my fit, and I'm so sorry for the messy bedroom. But this is my fit today. Super chill. Very fun, flirty. Got a spray tan, so I'm looking real tan and I'm loving it. So we're going to breakfast and here we go. And I'm so excited. It's so pretty here. Can't wait to get into the water and just spend some time with family. Of course, Nicholas. Where are we at, Nick? Turtle Sanctuary. Are you having the best time? I've had a turtle time. <laughs> Guys, we are at a turtle sanctuary. Jeez. And I'm dying because they are so cute. We're gonna join the turtle club. and went to heaven everyone died and went to heaven turtle heaven turtle heaven am i not poorly enough for the turtle club <laughs> The turtle sanctuary and Fire. fun fact they I can't go in there. Do you want to hold it? There we so go. So fun fact we just finished at the turtle sanctuary and they have them the hatchlings and then they release them into the wild when they're about two years old. You guys let me get a picture of you? Oh no we're vlogging. Right. Thank, Thank you though. Okay. Righteous. And yeah, so they released them to the wild, which I really enjoyed. Ninety percent of the turtles in this area come from this hatchling area or this place. Wild turtles, like wild when you turtles. see a wild turtle in the So they're really they're doing great work. And it was so fun. We got to swim with them, and I'm so excited that I couldn't vlog it. Something. Oh, 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 that's a 
That sucks. Ah. Look at that crap we're sitting in. Did they come on my legs? No, oh, babe, I'm the only one allowed to come on your legs. <laughs> you can't post that. I'm so gonna. Ow. No. That was so bad. Is it all there? Are they on me? Oh my gosh. Stop it. Anyways, we're gonna go eat some food and go to the beach. Beach day. And Nicholas is making sure I vlog today. He said he was really, what did you say this morning? Disappointed that I wasn't Not vlogging disappointed. more. Disappointed. Uh, I said a hard truth for her. And it matters. And the truth is, you're not doing enough vlogging. Okay, so I'm on my vlog game, sister. We're going to just make it work. And brothers. Right? Be aware of our humans. Kiss me. Okay. And non binary or whatever that means these days. Oh my gosh. We are off to dinner and we got caught. Oh, it's. Whew. A little foggy. Wonder why that happened. Okay. <laughs> We're off to dinner. We got caught in the biggest rainstorm, like soaked. So since we were so soaked, we were like, let's just go dip in the ocean. Mm hmm. It was fun. It was fun. A little chilly. So, here we go, off to dinner. It's not raining that much anymore. And, we're, I'm from Idaho, so humidity is really not a thing. So I don't even know why I try Step. to curl my hair or crimp it, because it's... I think it looks very nice for a whole 32 seconds. For a whole 32 seconds, it stays curled, and then it's, it's not curled anymore. Anyways, here we go. We're gonna check out the Westin. See how that looks, and if that's not good, we're going to Legends Bar and Grill. If that's not good, we still got the Ritz Carlton. Is that right? Yeah. The Ritz. The Ritz. That might be so, and the more I vlog, the more I realize how hard it is to vlog with someone who is six seven. Because he literally, you can't even see him when I go like this. I have to like go way up. It's getting it's foggy. Getting foggy. Yeah. It's getting foggy because it's humid, people. <laughs> okay, bye. We are going to Stingray City today. I'm so excited. This is the fit. Just some shorts and a crop. And then this really cute swimmy from, I think it's Slay, S-L-A on Instagram. It's so cute. Really cheeky bottoms though. And don't mind the mess. This is what, <laughs> this is what it looks like to travel with me. And then more mess and then oh wait more mess that's okay because we're on vacay and then i'm i keep saying i'm really excited so i'm trying to use different verbiage but today's about to be a good day it's not supposed to rain today it's been raining all week since we've or like the whole weekend we got here and yeah let's do this
being very terrible at actually filming anything besides of us walking places. That's all the time we have. We did a lot. Jeffrey, shut up! There are literally roosters everywhere and they start... What is a rooster? Like, how would you say that? Like, they don't... They cock little do. They're roostering at 3 a.m. I was like, aren't they supposed to do it at the sunrise? But they just do it whenever they want. It's island time, so they're thinking, like, get the fuck up, people. It's time so, to go. So I named Jeffrey. But it was Jeffrey, Jeremy, and James. Jim. 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 Jack But Jim goes by... James too, so it's true. But Jeffrey's the real prick. Yeah. So, anyways, we're walking to get some sushi, and we did a we had a big morning. We swam with stingrays, went to Starfish Point, got to see some real life starfish. We got yelled at for breaking the rules. Nick breaks every rule. Not supposed to do this, and he does it. So, but I'm excited to eat. I haven't had anything to eat today, and then we're probably just gonna have a beach day for the rest of the day. Oh, okay with it. Oh. I just want to go do stuff. Let's okay. do our hot girl, well, your hot girl walk. Oh yeah, so every night we've been doing hot girl walks. I saw this girl, I saw this girl on TikTok and she basically just like walked, ran for four months and she lost so much weight. And we have about three months until the wedding. So every night we're doing hot girl walks. And Nick doesn't like to call them hot girl walks. He calls them wedding walks. Even though I think he could use a hot girl walk. Okay, here we go. Humidity is killing me, folks. Humidity is killing me. This is my cute swimming today. Oh, that's Did you get it on tape? Yeah. That's pretty cool. Okay, so we're going, we're at dinner, and we're going to talk about our favorite part of the trip so far. You go first. My favorite part of the trip was when we went to the Turtle Oasis Turtle Sanctuary, and we got to the bridge where there is a predator barrier, and you see nerf, or nurse sharks, reef sharks, something like that. They're not dangerous or aggressive. Um, and Caitlin gives no shits about sharks. And all she thinks about is the turtles that she's swimming with. And she looks down and ah, this is so awesome! And comes up and looks at me and she goes, this is so amazing! And looks back down ah, under the water. This is so awesome! The amount of joy you had was very cute. Thank you. And I'm sitting over there just looking at turtles and chuckling myself as she's under the water. I can hear it. It was so squealing. cool. They, it was like, cool. They'd come it like was right cool. underneath you, so you were like, I don't know. It was the coolest. I thought it was cool. I thought it was fun at how much you enjoyed it. That was really good, right? My favorite part, I think so far, was we went to Stingray City and Starfish Point and the Stingrays were really beautiful really and cool. Nick is a rule breaker and he would try to swim underneath the Stingrays and these are wild Stingrays mind you so they still have their barbed stinger so yeah. But you were really cute there too. And you did, you were a great hype man. I got some good pictures. You're a great hype man. Thank you. I knew that. Also, I'd like to note that I'm not a rule breaker. I like to imagine the rule as this strong. It was kind of slightly bendy the song. Then you find you figure your way out to get what you want and still follow the rule. See? The straw, it still works. It's not broken. It's just bent. 
Now, a real breaker is that now this straw does not work. That is what I am. Bender, also, not breaker. Also, we're having these margaritas and they are spicy as all hell. My so my mouth is on fire right now. Why did you leave the cream? I have nothing else to say. Oh, uh, it's so. Uh, I need a water. Oh my god, it's so spicy. All right, she had the almond mango, which is a block of tequila, amaretto, orange, lime, and Tabasco. The so, Tabasco. So really the Tabasco is what's getting her. Ooh, I don't like spicy things, people. I don't like them. I don't like them at all. I tried the spicy margarita, which has three local pepper infused agave tequila. Spicy salt, agave nectar, and lime. I tried that. It was Which, very, very was, spicy. I just don't, I don't want it. It kind of hurt going down, so I'm kind of scared of it coming out later. <laughs> I think mine's spicier than yours. Try it. Okay, I'll give you that. I have a little zip to it. Here, you can have mine. No. Here. No. Yours. We're waiting for the sunset. The sun has been going, has been not peeking out. So we're waiting for that. Come on, sunset. Oh, this just in. This was Nick's idea, but we might be getting tattoos if he doesn't check it out. I thought it would be a fun idea, like a good memory keepsake. But then, and then we were out walking today, and I saw an old lady with a really trashy turtle tattoo. <laughs> That's all I could see. So I'm like, I don't know if I want one anymore, but... but we want to get like little baby ones. I'm not talking like your whole shoulder, unless that's what you were thinking. Uh-uh, just like this big, maybe? <laughs> no, like this big, like little. I'll get one on my thigh. Yeah, no one would ever see it. Right. So my Did you thighs... just steal my drink? Uh-oh, you said you're just too spicy. My thighs are kind of small. I got really small calves, so I don't have much real estate there, so I'll probably get like one this big. Awesome. Or my, maybe not, I don't know. Well, the other problem, you can't put the that other in my mind issue, and then we not do it. the other issue I'm having is I don't think you can get a tattoo on somewhere that you have sunburn. <laughs> But I'm pretty sunburned all over my back, my it's shoulder, really my face, sunburned. my chest, my arms. So really the only thing that's not... I get on my butt cheek. Oh, we can get them on our butt. I might do that, actually. We are really sunburned. Although, can you, can you, you have a man card if you go in there? And, at a crisscross, you can kind of see it a little bit. Is this where the X? I didn't show my boobs. It's a joke with your X across your chest. Uh, I'm not that bad. Right yeah, now. you can see it though. Don't flex but, this how you uh, can see it. But I think the, the beach is over uh, that way. My bicycle has handlebars like this. Anyways, the sun is about to set. So hopefully we can see it. I'm going to turn the camera and then you can see it with us. That's crazy.
today. Poofy bun. And then I'm tired of chafing because I've chafed so bad. So I am wearing biker shorts. And then we're starting to pack because we leave on Saturday. So this is our packing zone. It's still mess. Yeah. What's up? Today we're at the Queen's Botanical Garden. Mm -hmm. And we're looking Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> we're looking at the iguanas. So fun fact, they are pretty much would you say extinct? No, there's they're well here they're there's none left. So there's about, none left on the island because back in they 2019 just... they started paying the locals twenty dollars for a head that are alive and they were trying to ship them across to the other islands. Um, but obviously the dead are alive was easier to take them dead. So pretty much killed all the wild ones um, around the resorts area, resort areas, which is why they have a lot of a big chicken problem now because the iguanas are eating the eggs. And, well, there's no iguanas eat the eggs and there are a lot of chickens and roosters now. Look at them, eh? Yeah, that's a big one. That kind of looks like the ones you see in Mexico. Oh, look one up there. I know, I saw him. How did he get up there, I wonder? Climbing I, on it. I think he dropped from the tree. Because there's nothing for him to climb on. Gross. They have such small enclosures.
really documented none of my outfits but today's look is this just a cute skirt with a crop and then a cover up show it right here messy room again sorry not sorry this is it and then <laughs> Nick and I got tattoos I got a little turtle to go with my orca that's gonna be so cute and Nick I'll find him I got to roll back I'll report back on how they heal. We're going to the beach. This is our last night. So I did kind of start packing a little bit, but not really a ton. I almost wore every single outfit. Besides, it was so humid, so I didn't wear any of my blazers that I packed, even though they're super cute. But again, just so humid, I'm like, dripping so I have no makeup on decided the no makeup look is the look to go for but it's been just such a fun trip and we're so sad to leave <laughs> but last night here we go
back to work and civilization tomorrow. Today. Today. This is our last walk, and then we head to the airport. And I'm really quite sad about it. It was such a fun vacation. We'll start traveling at 10 and get home at midnight. So it's a nice, lovely day of travel. I know our flights kind of suck, so we fly from here to Miami then Miami to Arizona, and then Arizona to Boise. So it's a long day, but we've downloaded tons of things on our iPads, and we're gonna be great. Good. All while crying, because we're going to miss this perfectly blue water. And it's like 7 a.m. right now, and it's already 80, so. People are already swimming and snorkeling. Water's warm. Water's so warm. It is 89. Yeah. So sad. I'm so thankful for this time. Yeah, it was a good trip. <laughs> 